Welcome to Chair Yoga. My name is Julie. I'm so happy you could join me today. Please find a comfortable spot on a chair, with or without a pillow, with or without your shoes and socks. Have a water bottle handy, maybe some weights or some bottles or some cans. They're optional. Do what feels good for you and your body today. Take modifications as you need them. Take breaks if you need them. Today, we will focus on finding inner peace, letting inner peace radiate within and to those around us. Begin by placing one hand on your heart and one hand over your belly. Allow your weight to sink down into your chair. As you bring your feet about hip distance apart, right behind you, right underneath you. Relax into your space, let your eyelids flutter closed. Feel your breath come in and out of your body. As you feel your chest and belly lifting and lowering. Take a big breath in through your nose, fill all the way up. Big breath out through your mouth, let it go. Breathe in through your nose, fill up, feel your chest, your lungs expand. Open up, exhale, release. Breathe in through your nose, seal your lips. Hold at the top, breathe out through your nose. Keep breathing in and out through your nose. Find a pace that is comforting to you. As you begin to release tension and stress with each exhale to fill up with peace and calm with each inhale. Feel the weight of your body sink down into your chair. Allow the tension in your shoulders and your neck to begin to release with each breath you take. On your next inhale, release your hands from your belly and your heart and bring them down onto your lap. As you exhale, lean forward, then off to one side, back to the other side, and around. Make some full, gentle body circles here. Go nice and slow three times each way. Go at your own pace. When you come back to center, go the other way, go back, side, front, other side. Make these circles as big or as small as you like. And when you finish that third circle, Sit tall in your chair, rest your hands on your lap, face down for grounding and stability, face up for energy. Breathe in, breathe out. As you inhale, lift your shoulders up towards your ears. Exhale, let your shoulders come down. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower, that's it, nice. Start to feel more tension releasing through your body. As you lift and lower. If you have a shoulder that's giving you a problem today, maybe just lift one side and the other side, or to continue to breathe. If you have mobility in your shoulders as you inhale, lift up. Exhale, roll around, down, back to forward. Shoulder roll. That's it. One more. 
Let's go the other way. Come up, forward, back around. Roll your own face. You finish that last shoulder roll, relax into your spin. Take a breath in. Exhale, drop your chin down towards your chest. Stretch the back of your neck. Inhale, lift your chin parallel to the ground. Exhale, guide your chin toward the sky. Gently dip your head back. Inhale, lift your chin parallel to the ground. Exhale, lower it down towards your chest. Inhale. Exhale, dip your head back. Inhale, bring your chin back, parallel to the ground. Exhale, drop your right ear over towards your right shoulder. Stretch the left side of your neck. Inhale, lift your head up. Exhale, bring your left ear down to your left shoulder. One more time each side, a little faster. Lift. Lower. Lift. And lower. That's it. Inhale, lift your head up. And exhale, send your hands forward. Bring your hands right in front of you. Spread your fingers wide. And exhale, squeeze your hands shut tight. Open. Close. Open. Do that a couple more times. And squeeze shut tight. Flip one hand with palm up to the sky. Take your other hand and gently stretch your fingers on it. Get all the way to your thumb. Then switch hands with your other palm up. One at a time. And slide down your finger. Just come to your finger pad. Gently press back, stretching your fingers, your wrists. When you finish, roll your wrists out in a circular motion. Go a couple of times one way, a few times the other way. Rest your hands down on your lap. Lift one foot up. Rotate your ankles around in a circle, warming up your toes, your foot, your ankle, maybe even your leg if you are lifting it. Go around the other way a few times. Beautiful. You got it. Find stillness. Rest your foot down. Lift the other foot up. Bring it around in a circle. Nice. Slow and easy like you're moving through molasses. Go a few times the other way. We're honey. Whatever you prefer. Nice and sweet this morning to be together, this afternoon, this evening. Find stillness, take a breath in. And release your foot to your Lower your hands, face your palms outward towards me. Inhale, windmill your hands up over your head, bring your palms together. Exhale, draw the energy into your hearts. Lower your hands down. Inhale, lift up, bring your palms together to touch. Exhale, hands to your heart. Let's do this three more times. Pull your own pace. Lower. Lift. Draw in. And down. Take two more windmills on your own. Pull the energy above you. And that piece right into your heart center. Bring your palms together. Pull your thumbs right in to touch your body at your heart center. I invite you to set an intention or dedication for your chair yoga practice today. It can be a word, a phrase, a name, or a wish. My intention today is knowing when you control your breath. Nothing and no one can steal your feet. 
May the peace that you generate in your practice today radiate out to all those you care about, to all those you love. Let's seal this intention together. Whatever your intention is, or you would like to share mine, please breathe it in. So all the way up, breathe in. deep, deep, deep. And exhale, send the intention out. Awesome. Bring your hands to your heart. You can also bring them to the sides of your chair, to your arms. Inhale, cow pose. Push your belly out. Draw your shoulders back. Exhale, cat pose. Pull your shoulders forward. Dome through your back, your shoulders, your whole spine. Look down. Inhale, cow pose. Exhale, cat. That's it. Really arch. Inhale. Exhale, cat. We're going to add a knee lift here. We call it dancing cat. Inhale, cow. Exhale, cat. Draw your knee up towards your nose. And then lower down. Inhale, cow. Exhale, dancing cat. Lift your other knee up towards your nose. One more time, each side. Inhale, cow. Exhale, dancing cat. There you go. Inhale, cow. Exhale, dancing cat. Rest your foot down on the ground. Sit up tall, proud in your chair. Lengthen through your spine. Draw the crown of your head toward the sky. Let's get ready to move. Are you ready? Let's do it. Inhale, mountain pose. Reach your arms up over your head. Fire your pinkies inward toward each other. Gently press your feet into the ground as you lift up through your side body. Take a breath in. Exhale, side bend to the right. Send your hands over to the right side of the room. Option to grab your left wrist. Pull up and Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, side bend to the left. Option to grab your right wrist. Pull up and over. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, baby back bend. Practice your arms. Bend your elbows out to shoulder height. Then lean back in your chin. Lift your heart toward the sky. Look up. Guide your elbows toward each other as you breathe. Open up through your heart center. Inhale, mountain pose. Lift back up. Exhale, forward fold. Bring your hands to your heart. Draw your chest towards your thighs. And release your hands to your knees. And either bring your hands on your knees, your shins, or all the way to your toes or to the ground. Tuck your chin in towards your chest. Breathe in and breathe out. As you rise back up, bring your hands to your knees, your shoulders, your head. Relax. Breathe in. Breathe out. We'll make breath to movement. Follow your breath. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, side bend to the left. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, baby dog. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, forward fold. Go to where you're comfortable going. Maybe just to your knees or all the way to the ground. Breathe in. Breathe out. You can touch your toes. Do so. You slide up to your knees, your shoulders, your head. Relax. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, mountain pose. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, exhale, baby. Inhale, exhale, breathe in. Breathe in. You can't touch your toes, your knees, your shoulders, your head. Thank you.
Inhale, reach your arms up and Exhale, drop your hands, your arms down to the right side of your chair. As you inhale, pull up on your chair. Exhale, twist. Rotate through your torso, your spine, your shoulders, your neck, and your eyes. Inhale, lift your arms. Exhale, drop your hands, your arms to the other side of your chair. Find a grip there. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, twist. Rotate through your lower back, your shoulders, and if you can, your neck and your eyes. We'll move a little faster. Inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, drop them down. Inhale, pull up. Exhale, twist. Inhale, lift up. Inhale, warrior pose. Bring one foot in front of you, your right foot, your left foot out at the back. Come on, stretch your foot out. Reach your arms out to your side. If you can stand up, you're more than welcome to. You have your chair here to grab if you need it. Always know that you'll get a good stretch and workout seated in your chair. Take a breath in. Exhale, start to circle your arms forward. If it's hard for you to extend your leg out, maybe just bring it out a little bit. Circle forward. Energetically, draw your hands in a circle as you stretch your fingertips away from each other, opening up through your heart center and your shoulders. Circle. You got it. Nice work. That's it, yogis. Keep going. Eight. Seven. Six, five, four, reverse in three. Yes, you can. Two, one, reverse. Stay strong. Use your breath. Let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, hold in two, one. Pause. Take a breath in. Exhale, extended side angle pose. Bring your right forearm to your right thigh. Make sure left arm up. Options here, you can bring your arm in front of your thigh for a little extra stretch. Outside of your foot for a little more. Your outside of your thigh or calf for extra stability. Either way, breathe into your stretch. Lift up through your left side body. Nice. Inhale, reverse warrior. Bring your top arm down to your outstretched leg. Lift the other arm up and then down. Breathe as you look up at your hand or down at your outstretched foot. Whatever feels best for you, back. Inhale, star pose. Bring your arms up like a V. Send your legs out like a V. Stay stable in your chair. If you need to, make a little V. If you're standing, you can stand up, star pose. Always excellent to be seated. You get a great workout, a great stretch. Take a breath in. Exhale, hands and feet together. Inhale, warrior pose the other side. Bring your left foot out slightly and extend your right leg. As you exhale, reach your arms out. Take a breath in. And so just push your palms up and down. You're pulsing here. A little different movement in your shoulders. Building strength in your arms. Pushing up and down. You got it. 
Nice work. Excellent. Breathe. But anytime you need to take a break, feel free. If anything hurts, stop. Or if only one shoulder is working today, that's fine. We're here for eight. Palms up in seven, six, five, four, three. Flip your palms in two, one. Flip them up, little pulses up, up. So strong, stronger than you think. Breathe into it, lift, lift. Yes, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, and one. Flip your palms back down, take a breath. Exhale, extended side angle, same option on this side. Bring your forearm to your thigh, lift your right arm up. Option to bring your forearm to the inside of your thigh. Put a little extra hip opening to the outside of your thigh or calf. So a little more stability. Any option is good. You can look up, look down or straight ahead. Yeah, inhale, star pose. Bring your arms up like a V, stretch. Send your legs out like a V. If you need to modify, feel free. If you want to stand up, you can. Take a breath in. Yeah, shine bright. Exhale, hands and feet together. Nice work. Rest your hands down, breathe in. Breathe out. We do that sequence again, this time a little bit faster. Inhale, warrior pose. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, stretch back. Inhale, star pose. Exhale, hands and feet. Relax your hands down. Breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, warrior pose, the other side. Exhale, extended side angle. Inhale, reverse warrior. Exhale, stretch back. Inhale, star pose. Exhale, hands and feet together. Nice work. We add a, a star pose variation. Inhale, right to star pose. Exhale, lift one knee up. Bring your hands together. See if you can touch your elbow too. If you can't, that's okay. Just do what you can. Inhale, star. Exhale, lift, star, and lift. You're going to use your core strength here as you lift and lower. You're here for eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, two, and one nice job and you'll start. Exhale, hands and feet together, relax your face down. Send your right leg out in front of you. Point your toes to the sky, your heels toward the ground. Keep your hands right now on your sides of your chair, arm rest on you. Lower your heel down. Lift it up. Option to lift just a little bit. You can lift a little higher up to your hip or knee height. Lift. Squeeze your quadriceps. Maybe have your hand on the top of your leg to feel your muscles engage. Maybe you're taking a little movement today, or maybe just wiggling your toes. As long as you're moving, as long as we're grooving together, you're in the right place. As long as you're breathing, chair yoga is for you. You're here for eight. Can you feel it? Seven. Six, five, last four, last three, last two, last one, lower your so shake it out again. Put your other leg up, your left leg up, toes to the sky, heel down, lower, and then option to bring your hand to your leg, feel your quadriceps and raise. Take a variation if you need it. Bring your hands where you're comfortable. Lift. Lift. Breathe. 
Yeah. And you feel this side. You're here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last two. Last one. Lift. Shake your legs. We'll stretch out a moment. Option to bring your hands to your sides of your chair or your armrests as we lift both legs. Get one leg forward and the other. Pull your lower belly in. Use support of your chair if you need to. Use your core strength and your leg strength to lower and lift. Lower and lift. Option to send your arms up for a little extra. It's up to you. If it starts to strain your low back, bring your hands down for support. Or keep them stretched up. Maybe you have a pillow behind you. You can lean back as you lift. Lift. You're here for eight. Just seven. So strong. Five. Four, three, last two, last one, rest your arms, and your hands to your lap, and your belly over your thighs, your forehead towards your shins, your head towards your toes. Option here to put weights in your hands if you have light weights or water bottles or cans. Bring them lightly into your hands with a light grip. Or if you've got the can, you might need to hold it a little tighter. Take a breath in. Exhale. Squeeze your hands up towards your shoulders. Lower. Lift. Lower. Lift. That's it. Squeeze. Strong. Try not to swing, rather come up slow and squeeze. That's it. Yeah, you got it. Lift. Lift. Squeeze. Weights are always optional. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Pull them out in two. Last one. Hold your weights so they're facing me, but your elbows are still there. Take little pulses up. up. Isolating that bicep muscle. Breathe as you lift. Lower. An inch or two up and down. Squeeze. Squeeze. That's it. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. We're going to add a knee lift in three. Two. And one, lower your weights down. As you exhale, lift one knee up, draw your hands to your shoulders. Lower, bring the other knee up, hands to your shoulders. If you need to modify, you can. Maybe just do your legs or just do your arms. If you need a break, breathe. Breathe. Lift one arm up, lift it without the weight of spine, lift the opposite leg up. Lower that arm and leg, opposite arm, opposite leg. With weights, it looks like this. Lift and lower, lift and lower. See if you can get the coordination of doing opposite. Bring our brain a little shift, a little workout. Opposites. Lift. 
In yoga, we build strength, flexibility, balance, focus, determination, and hopefully, by the end, peace and well-being. That's our goal, my friends. So do what feels good for you. As you lift, lift. Just eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, last two. Last one, last. Big shoulder roll back. Oh, yeah. Big shoulder roll forward. And face your hands toward each other. If you have your weights, you can grab them like columns. Pull your elbows into your side. You have arm rest. You have to separate your hands a little more. Take a breath in. Exhale. Send your hands to the wall behind you. For tricep extensions. Then extend back. Then straighten the weights. It's like this. Feel pretty quickly in those triceps. Nice work, yogis. Pull it in, go back. In, back. Maybe lift a little higher to feel that in your tricep. Yeah. Awesome work. Keep breathing. You got it. Eight, see that? Seven. Six, five, nice. Four, three, last two. Last one, hold it up. Little pulses, little bend, little extension. Without weight, you're still getting something out of this. Oh yeah, I can feel it. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Oh yeah, dig deep, it's eight, seven, six, five, four, three, hold in two, last one. Oh yeah, bring your hands in, rest your weights down if you have them. Send one arm out to shoulder height, draw it across your body till your hand reaches your opposite shoulder. You take it nice and stretch through your arms, other hand is available and working. Use it. Yeah, then release. Bring your arm out. This time face your palm up. Take your opposite hand, just a little wrist and arm stretch all the way down through that, through your biceps, your arm and hand. Same thing, other side, lift your arm up, shoulder height, draw it across your body to your opposite shoulder. Other hand is working. Yeah, give yourself a little stretch here. Breathe into it. Release your arm out, flip your palm up. Take your opposite hand gently. Hold down on your fingers to stretch through your wrist, your whole biceps, your arm. Option here to lift up your weight, we'll do some chest press, shoulder press. Bring your arms up like a cactus. You had that before in the baby back bend. Face your palms out, take a breath in. Exhale, push your hands up to the sky. Lower and lift. Lower, lift. That's it. Focus on your breath. Your breath is your power. Want to make a loud exhale? You can. Make sure to keep your hands right over your shoulders as you press up. Option to smile. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Can you feel it? Eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last two, last one, 
Lower your hands back down like a goal pose. You close your elbows, your hands together. Open, close, open, and close. Keep breathing. We'll add a compound movement in eight, seven, weights are optional, six, five, four, last three, last two, last one, hold them up, it's up, down, close, and open, up, down, close, and open, up, down, breathe, you've got this, we're almost done, just four more, yeah, last three, last two, oh yeah, so strong, stronger than you think, push up, down, close, Open, release the weight down. We're done with those for now. Shake out your hands, shake out your shoulders. Shoulder roll back. Shoulder roll. Interlace your hands and bring them behind your head. Or you can bring your fingertips lightly behind your ears if that's easier. Also, option to bring your hands to your hips. As we begin to engage your core, your core muscles all the way around the circumference of your back and belly. Take a breath in. Exhale, dip to the right. Keep your chest lifted, working the sides of your abdominals. Lift up. Dip to the left. Lift and lower. Good job. Lift. Lower. Breathe as you lean. Use those core muscles to lift yourself back up. That's it. Nice work. Yeah. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Last two. We're going to pulse to the right in one. Lift and pulse. Pulse, building strength in your sides for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, other side in two, one, lift and pulse. If this is starting to hurt your shoulders, leave your hands to your hips, keep pulsing, eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Lift up, bring your hands to your heart, breathe in. Breathe out. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, prayer twist to the right. Look over your right shoulder if you can. Twist through your spine, your belly, your shoulders, your neck, and your eyes. Inhale, center. Exhale, prayer twist the other way. See what you can see behind you. We'll move a little faster. Inhale, center. Exhale, prayer twist to the right. Inhale, center. Exhale, prayer twist to the left. One more time. Each way, go at your own pace. Maybe recall the intention that you set at the beginning of class. Breathe it in, and send it out, come back to center, breathe in, peace to you, send out peace to someone you care about, breathe in, peace, send out any tension that you still hold in your body, breathe in, peace, send out any stress. Bring your hands to your side. Inhale, lift your arms up over your head. 
Exhale, eagle pose on the right. Bring your right arm under your left. You can cross at your elbows and your wrists. Bring your palms together. Or grab your opposite shoulder. Press your left foot into the ground. Lift your right leg up and down. That's difficult. Cross your leg. Cross your ankle. Then crossing at your thigh. Or just sit up straight in your chair. You can bring your foot behind your opposite leg. Go for it. Take a breath in. Exhale, bow forward, bring your elbows towards your thigh, tuck your chin. Inhale, lift. Exhale, go back. We continue our core strengthening here. Going across your transverse abdominal, lift, lean back, lift, lean back. Remember, you can take any variation with the crossing of your arms or your legs. Just try to cross something and squeeze tight. Just maybe give yourself a hug. That's cool. You're doing great. Keep it up. Just four. Three. Nice work. Last two. Last one. Sit up. Nice and tall. Squeeze. Squeeze tight. Take a breath in. Exhale. Unwind your arms and cross your legs. Take a moment to feel freshly oxygenated blood shoot down to your fingers. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe in. Inhale, lift your arms up. Exhale, eagle pose, other side. Keep your left arm under your right. Option to bring your palms together if you can cross at your elbows and your wrists. Grab the opposite shoulders, hug tight, either way. Press your right foot into the ground, lift your left foot up and over. Cross at your ankles, your legs, your thighs. So you bring your foot behind your opposite leg. Feel the Take a breath in. Exhale, lean over to the right. Lean up. Lean over to the left. Lift. And lean. Lift. Now we're working back in those oblique muscles again. This time you've got your arms and legs a little bit twisted. Working your ankles, your knees, your hips, your elbows, your wrists, shoulders, scapula. So good for you. Breathe it in for eight, seven, six, just five. Four, three, last two, last one, sit up tall, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze tight, take a breath in, exhale, unwind, nice work, across your legs, and take a moment to feel the tingling in your fingers, all the way down to your toes. Breathe in that energy, so positive, send the energy out. Beautiful. Inhale, lift your arms over your head. Exhale, bring your palms to heart center. Press your left foot into the ground. Lift your right leg up and pop it over your back. And move into tree pose. So if you want to stand up, you want to do a standing tree, you can bring your foot down as a kickstand, lift it anywhere that's comfortable to you. You always have your chair behind you for balance. Perfectly fine to do this posture seated as well. You're seated, cross your legs comfortably. Anywhere you want. As you inhale, lift your hands straight up over your head. You exhale, separate your hand back, creating a canopy. Imagine beautiful leaves above you. The sun is shining, the sky is bright. You're surrounded by Mother Nature and oxygen, making you imagine this in your life. As you breathe in, a breeze blows, and you move as you breathe out, and in. Move any way you want. If you're standing, you want to stay stationary, that's fine. Do moving meditation here. Find 
find stillness. You breathe in, lift your branches toward the sun. Breathe out, pull the energy right into your heart center. Bring both feet to the ground, breathe in. And cross your other leg, however you want. Whatever works for you, if you want to stand up, you can use your foot as a kickstand. Hold on to your chair, lift your foot up to your inner thigh. Whatever works best for you. And feet in his own time. Press one foot to the ground, imagine the roots. Keeping you strong and stable and grounded as you lift your hands up over the head to the back. Exhale, separate your arms out. Imagine the beauty of the earth, the sky, nature around you. Begin to blow in the breeze if you like. This meditation can be in stillness or in movement, and it's your choice. Find stillness here. Lift your branches to the sky as your trunk grows taller and your roots go deeper. Fill it with peace. Take a breath in. Exhale, bring your hands to your heart center. Bring both feet to the ground. Rest your hands on your heart. Breathe in. Breathe in. Send your legs out wide. Why is you're comfortable taking them? You can have a very big V, a little V with your legs, whatever works for you. Option to bring your hands to the tops of your thighs, the front of your chair for stability. Safety first, and make sure you're securing your chair here. Option to bring your hands to your hips. Take a breath and lift your heart. Excellent. Wide legged forward, forward, and seated. Slide your hands down your legs or maybe bring them to the ground. Go slide out of your chair. <laughs> Breathe in, relax your neck. Draw your thighs, your chest toward your thighs as you breathe in and out. And then slowly come back up. Use your core strength to slide your hands back up your legs. And you continue to breathe. Send your legs straight out in front of you. Absolutely. Up your chest. And exhale, see your forward fold. Slide your hands down. And like maybe you grab your toes. Do not. And pull your belly over your legs. Relax your back. And breathe in. And breathe out. If you don't have that kind of mobility, and you're sitting up in your chair. See if you can pull your belly a little closer to your thighs. Get one inch more every day. You've got to move it or lose it. If you can make it a daily practice, that's even better. To stretch every muscle, fiber, to massage all the organs in your body, building strength in your bones, your heart. Every organ, breathe in, breathe out, and slide back up however far you came down. Come to your seated position, sit tall and proud. Breathe in, breathe in. Lift one foot up if you can, cross your ankle over your opposite leg. If you're sitting, does it work like that for you? Cross ankle over ankle or just sit up in your chair. Place one hand on your knee, one hand on your ankle. Inhale, lengthen your spine. Exhale, seated, half pigeon pose. Draw your belly towards your leg. Your forehead towards your chin. Allow your low back to relax to help stretch your hips and cross your legs. Breathe in. Breathe out. Draw the crown of your head a little closer to the earth. 
I invite you to consciously release worry. It does not serve you. So let it go off the top of your head to make room for peace, for love and compassion. So much better than worry. Let it go. And then your next inhale, rise up. Exhale, bring both cheeks to the ground. Move to the other side. Lift your opposite leg up. Cross it. Again, if your hip does not work this way right now, no worries. Sit up in your chair. You pull forward. Massage the hip. Just cross it. Ankle, whatever works. Otherwise, bring one hand to your knee, one hand to your knee. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, seated half pigeon hips. Find balance here, not just in your body, but of ease and effort. Maybe push yourself just a little more, but not too far that you feel any pain or discomfort. Just to the edge. And a nice stretch in your hip, the back. And once again, I invite you to draw the crown of your head a little closer to the ground. To release doubt. To release stress. Making room for peace, love, compassion. Take a breath in, then out. Inhale, rise up, and exhale. Do inhale, stretch your arms forward in front of you at shoulder height and cross them like a big X. Exhale, bring your hands back towards your armpits. Draw your elbows together. So pretty good. Inhale, stretch forward, cross, dome through your upper back. And exhale, pull your hands back towards your side body. Two more times on your own pace. Follow your breath, my friend. Nice work, one more time. Beautiful. Bring your hands back. Bring them together and interlace them. Like a bath paper. Squeeze your palms together tight. Tight, tight, tight. Release. Place your palms toward you and stretch your arms forward. That feels good. Hold here. Move on. Lift your arms up over your head. Breathe in. Exhale. Side bend. Inhale. Lift up. Exhale. Side bend to the left. One more time, each side lift and stretch. Oh, yeah. Lift and stretch. And inhale. And exhale. Flip your palms back together. And unwind your fingers, bring your pads of your fingers and thumbs to touch. Rub them together. Rub your hands, create some heat. You'll find that heat stop. Rub your hands over your eyes. Gently with your eyes open or closed. Inhale, look up. Exhale, look down. Look up. Look down. Keep going at your own pace. Moving your eyes. Whole body workout. On your next round, find stillness. Close your eyes for a moment. Relax. Your eyes open or closed. Look to the right as you inhale. The left as you exhale. Look right. Nice and slow. Look left. Keep going at your own pace. Look each way. Relax. 
Do that one more time, each side. And close your eyes. And gently take your thumbs to the sides of your head and move them around in a circle to give yourself a little head run. Go around each way a couple times. You feel okay. And find stillness. Do the same thing with your fingers. Massaging your forehead. You want to move them to the side a little you can. And keep massaging toward all your fingers come toward the back of your head, toward the back of your neck. Come to the upper part of your neck. Roll them around each time, a couple times, each way, you move your head side to side. If we were together in person, I would love to give you a gentle back and a shoulder rub, neck rub with some essential oils, but this isn't bad. Hopefully we'll be together someday. Release your hands to your upper shoulders, lower part of your neck, whatever feels right. Massaging those muscles that you move, lifting and lowering. Take your hands across and across your chest to find your shoulders with opposite hands. Massaging those muscles that you're moving up and down. It should feel pretty warm. Lower your hands down to your biceps, biceps, tricep curls. With your fingers, you can get into the triceps. Your thumbs will get the biceps. Lower your hands to your forearms. Nice and massage, yeah. Lower your hands to your thighs, those quads. Take a couple circles each way. Lower your hands down to your calves and shins. Maybe your feet if you want. Massage, relax your head. And come back up. Bring your hands to your lap. Face down for stability. Face up for energy. Relax your shoulders. Option here to close your eyes. You've done it, made it to the best part of class where you'll sit and absorb the beautiful positive energy that you created around you in your movements today. From the top of your head down your neck, down your shoulders to your fingertips, completely relax. Relax from your neck, down your throat, across your shoulders, your chest, your heart. Relax your hips and sink down into your chair. Relax your bottom, your legs, all the parts that are connected to your chair. Let the chair and earth support you. From your hips all the way down to your toes, relax. Relax your eyes, relax your nose, your mouth, your jaw. Allow your tongue to fall to the bottom palate of your mouth. Relax your whole face, the whole front of your body. Relax the whole back of your body. And just be, for the next minute, just relax. I'll let you know when it's time to move.
begin to awaken now. Bring your awareness back to your breath. Make little movements in your fingers, your toes. Slowly move your head side to side, up and down. And with a yes, keeping it positive. Take one last full stretch of your arms up over your head. Breathe in. Next, you'll bring your hands to your heart center. We'll end class with three unified breaths. Breathe in through your nose. Go all the way up. Breathe out through your mouth. Let it go. Breathe in calm. Release any tension that remains. Breathe in peace to you. Breathe out peace to those you care about. Lift your thumbs. Place them onto your forehead, right between your eyebrows. The light, the love in me sees, honors, respects, and is grateful for the light and love in you. Think about forward as we share a last word of class. Namaste. The word namaste literally means in Sanskrit, I bow to you. It's a sign of our mutual respect, affection, and gratitude. May the peace that you generated in your practice today radiate to those around you. When you need to recenter and find peace again, find your breath, find the power of your breath, May you have peace today and every day. Thank you so much. Until next time.